We are Sean, Emma, Rex and Maggie and in this series we head on a tour of South West Scotland in Rennie, our motorhome. In this episode we head to Kiratree Forest, part of the Galloway Forest Park for a night off-grid. signs are really good so there's big brown sign off the main road yeah and then going up this forest road there's lots of signs it's telling you signs. which way to go so yeah. just follow the signs Definitely. don't worry about the sat nav ignore the sat nav the sat nav is currently sending us around in a big circle <laughs> yeah. very confused yeah So the, this is the car parking charges. So um, when it says car all day, that's also for the motorhome. It just says it here. Um, so it's three pound all day to park in most of these places. And like I said, most of them just take coins, but it says here, we can stay the night here and you just purchase two full day tickets or you can pay at the cafe when it's open. Um, and that's, so you, are valid from 6 till 10 a.m. for your night ticket for motorhomes. How cool is that? The dogs and I have just left Sean. He's gone off to do the red mountain bike trail today. Um, we're just gonna have a short walk, probably a couple of miles, um, but I'm hoping there'll be a nice viewpoint. Kiratree Forest is one of the popular Seven Stains mountain bike centres in the larger Galloway Forest Park. With views over the Irish Sea in the distance, an abundance of wildlife and a dark sky park status, it's got loads to offer. This walk is just amazing. Um, the forest is so green and lush with all the moss at the moment. Lots of mushrooms around and look at that view. You probably can't see it very well on the GoPro, but I've taken some pictures, so I'll insert them here. So the walk I am doing today is the 50th anniversary walk um, for um, Galloway Forest. So this trail was put in to celebrate that. Um, obviously that was quite a long time ago. <laughs> so um, 1997 it says there. It's an absolutely lovely little walk this one. It's quite um, a little bit hilly but other than that it's absolutely beautiful. Some amazing views. An amazing forest area to walk through. Um, so yeah, so we'll see what we've got next. So while Emma goes and takes the dogs for a walk, I'm going to hit the red trail here at Kiratree.
Not too much though. <laughs> Otherwise you'll end up doing that. So the dogs and I made it back to the van. Sean's still out on the red mountain bike trail. So we've just had a bit of lunch and I've spotted that they've got a wildlife hide down the bottom there. And um, so I'm going to go and take a look. I'm probably going to take my big camera um, and big lens down and see what wildlife we can actually see. Right, top tip from Sean. A little hack that, that I actually... Well, you stole it really. It's I've not yours, is it? it? It's not mine. <laughs> Somebody else's. Yes, yeah, so bike rack. And if you've got a dropper post and you got... Is it for when the van, like there's not in, like there's a bit of gradient by the back of the van? Yeah, so normally I put the seat in here. Yeah. But because we're on a, um, a, a slope. slope, the seat won't fit in there. So if you pop the bike underneath there so the seat goes underneath the rails pop the dropper post up Ta -da! Ta -da. Magic. bike stand bike stand magic <laughs> the blue trail at kiratree is approximately six and a quarter miles or 10 kilometers with 50 percent single track to start with, the blue and red follow the same climb which is quite technical with roots and rocks, then goes into a long fire road section with fabulous views. Most of the descending single track on the blue is shared with the red so it's quite technical in places but all rollable. If you're looking for a fun technical blue with a decent amount of single track, Kiratree should definitely be on your ride list. The Kiratree Blue Trail was definitely my favourite blue so far of the Seven Stains locations, with Glentress and Newcastleton still to ride. So I've been out, so we stayed here last night in the van. 
very nice night. We had a sky full of stars, yeah, didn't we? We've taken some pictures, absolutely yeah. amazing. I mean, it's worth coming here just for that, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, well, the guys next to us, thats they just came and just to, to look at the dark sky, so yeah. And it wasn't that cold in the evening, but he did get cold overnight, yeah, it got didn't cold it? Night, yeah. We, we actually slept in our Rudy's last yeah, night. Didn't it was we? so cold. Yeah. So this morning, I have been out and done the blue trail here, and I would say um, a quick, just a quick review. Um, it's the best blue I've done so far on this trip. Yeah, which is good. But we're hoping to head over to Glentress next. So Sean's saving himself for that. He's decided not to go yeah. and do the black here today because you've already done the red. Yeah. Um, and we're going to hopefully head over to Glentress in the next couple of days. Now we're due some bad weather tomorrow and Friday, um, but actually we've got no signal here. So we haven't checked that in the last no, 24 might have hours. Changed. So it might have changed. Yeah. Um, but we are what we are hoping to do on the way over is go and see Grey Mare's waterfall which is the largest waterfall in this area i don't know what maggie's doing it's rex uh, it's, yeah. <laughs> um it's her dinner i think yeah. um yeah so we're hoping to do that um on the way to glentress um because it's a bit of a drive from here it's about an hour's drive i think um so yeah so hopefully we'll get to do that probably what day is it today wednesday hopefully get to do that on friday or saturday and then from sunday for a few days we're going to explore glentress and we're hopefully going to do the green the blue and the red yeah aren't yeah. we okay um and then that will be six of the seven stains we will have done yes um we will. we've just got newcastleton to go there yeah and um, hopefully if the weather's good next week we'll try and get there before we have to head home unfortunately yeah so that's the uh, that's the plan for the next few days. Um, I wish this weather would last, but I don't think it's going to. No, it's not going to. Absolutely think. lovely today. Yeah. We're out in t-shirts. It's gorgeous. Um, so yeah. So we'll see you on the road. Join us next time when we leave Dumfries and Galloway and make our way to the Tweed Valley, doing some sightseeing along the way. <laughs>